Hey campers, welcome back to Must See Tech. Today we've got an exciting preview of all new camping vans that will be departing on a quest of outdoor exploration in 2024. Whether you're a seasoned off-road tripper or an amateur weekend adventurer, you will not want to miss the incredible lineup we're about to show you. We'll be covering everything from space-efficient floor plans and heavy-duty travel chassis to eco-friendly power systems. So grab your camping chair, sit back, and join us on this journey into the future of camping on wheels. Do not forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell. We roll! Winnebago Solus Pocket 36B Two years ago, Winnebago finally chose to explore the lower price market segment and introduced their cheapest offering, Solus Pocket. The all-new floor plan of 2024, the 150 Grand 36B, is a far cry from the planned price point below 100,000. But fortunately, you do get a whole bunch of new capability. This 18-footer still rides on the Ram Pro Master chassis, powered by a 280 HP, 3.6 liter V6 gasoline engine with a 9-speed automatic transmission. Departing from the open, multifunctional space of the original 36A layout, the 36B prioritizes creature comforts. Notably, the rear gear garage bedroom was replaced by a wet bathroom, equipped with indoor and outdoor shower, portable toilet and sink. The interior doubles as a mudroom for wet gear storage. The sleeping area moves to the center of the van with an innovative sofa lounge that transforms into eight various configurations, including a double bed. The kitchen area, featuring a gas stove and indoor-outdoor access refrigerator, is complemented by a drop-down table for outdoor use. Additionally, the Solar Pocket 36B offers an optional EcoFlow PowerKit Pro package, providing three days of off-grid power with a lithium-ion battery and a rooftop solar array. Then do it, move. Back in 2022, Ford came to Van Duet, requesting the company's help to showcase the adventure potential of their new transit trail van. The company did not refuse, so at the official debut, the van was equipped with some Van Duet camper components. In February 2023, the manufacturer presented the prototype of the camper, and now it arrives ready for production under the name Move. Instead of adapting the modules from the brand's past Ford Transit builds, the van gets designed from the ground up and comes fitted with all new equipment, created with the feedback from Van Duet buyers. The only thing that was kept was the familiar aluminum T-Track skeleton used for mounting everything on the walls. Inside you get a kitchen module with a fridge light, an adjustable lagoon table, a TV, a portable toilet and a deployable shower. The latter is equipped with an 83-liter freshwater tank and an electric water heater. There are three bed options, the novel drawbridge bed, a hydraulic bed that descends from the ceiling, or a Murphy bed system that can be arranged as bunks. Buyers can choose between three electric system options, several roof racks, and three suspension updates. The flagship Stage 3 off-road update adds Fox rear shocks, a Bilstein front struts with upgraded coils, and added OEM leaves. Airstream Interstate 19X Just a couple of years ago, Airstream were manufacturing only luxurious touring coaches for highway travels. But as of 2024, their lineup includes three adventure vans. Among them is the all-new Interstate 19X, that rides on a 19-feet version of the Mercedes Sprinter 144 chassis. The base model is equipped with the older 188-horsepower 3.0-liter V6 turbo diesel engine and a selectable 4x4 system. Alternatively, customers can upgrade to the 211HP 2.0-liter 4-cylinder diesel and a more modern all-wheel drive system with a 50-50 torque split. In either configuration, the van receives rugged enhancements including a protective coating on the hood and lower body, a brush guard with auxiliary lights, and all-terrain tires mounted on black wheels. Utility over luxury approach means that the Airstream Interstate 19X gets a single layout option with a dual bench dinette 
that can be turned into a transfer double bed using a cushion connect. Tight cabin still manages to fit two countertops, a sink, a microwave, and an 88-liter fridge. Plus, there is a bathroom unit with its own sink, shower, and a toilet. Expectedly, the interior is air-conditioned, and your nomad activities will be powered by a 100 ampere hour battery, 2 kilowatts inverter, and a 250 watt solar panel. Weinsberg Cara Life 630MQ The new definition of the Cara lifestyle was presented by the latest model from the German RV builder Weinsberg. Individual style was prioritized when designing the interior concept of this van. The cabin is flooded with light during the day through a sunroof, and at night the cozy ambience is created by fairy lights. The wall paneling is not just for show, there are plenty of integrated aluminum profiles that can be used to customize the interior. The Carol Life 630MQ gives an option between two upholstery fabrics for the seating areas that transform from dinette to an extra bed at night. Those are Savannah Beige or Alaska Grey. The Cara Kitchen has an L-shape with a large worktop, two-burner hub, 90-liter fridge freezer compartment, and a 32-inch smart TV that can be unfolded for exterior use as well. As for the bathroom amenities, Weinsberg decided to save space and went for a concealed cassette toilet and an innovative folding shower cubicle that is there only when you need it. As we continue unveiling the hottest camper vans of tomorrow, Make sure to smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. We want you in our club of camping enthusiasts. Let's keep rolling. Crosscamp Flex 541 Owned by the Irvenheimer Group, the German Crosscamp adds a new camper van to its range, now based on the Apple Movano. As its name suggests, the Flex 541 focuses on flexibility of use and measures 541 centimeters or 213 inches in length. The model borrows many features from other vans built by Heimer, ditching the traditional European floor plan with a rear folding bed. Instead, it gets a front double bed that folds into a wall or functions as a sofa. There is also a three-legged table for dining, which can be removed and used outside. The walls are covered with plank-style wood paneling that both look good and serve for mounting accessories and gear. The kitchen unit occupies almost the entire passenger side of the van. It includes a dual burner stove, a sink with a 10-liter water jug, a 70-liter fridge, and plenty of storage drawers and cabinets. Crosscamp even equips the Flex with a quick-deploy shower room, though to use it, you will need to add extra water tanks, since the mentioned 10-liter canister is the only water supply added from the factory. Finally, we should mention that you can add extra sleeping area by opting for pop-up top, and all of the furniture inside the Flex is modular or removable, allowing to create 14 different interior floor plans. Kimberly Cruise Wagon Previously known for their caravans and trailers, the Australian Kimberly Campers are introducing their first camper van model designed with a focus on off-grid adventures and unparalleled comfort. Based on the Sprinter all-wheel drive platform, the new two-sleeper features a powerlift queen-size bed that moves up with a push of a button, leaving the entire dining area free during the day. The latter easily accommodates up to six guests. The central part of the cruise wagon houses a spacious galley kitchen. On the side, you'll find an induction cooktop with a sink, while on the other side, there is a standing 130-liter fridge, an under-counter microwave, and several bamboo veneered shelving units. The drawer front panel is the only timber used by Kimberly, as the Australians rely on high-grade alloys, composite materials, and stainless steel for lightweight and weather resistance purposes. Those who prefer cooking in the open air can use the slide-out kitchen at the rear, which has a sink and a dual-burner stove. Also, instead of the stove, you can opt for a gas or electric Weber grill. The off-grid capability is highly customizable, but the starting point will be a 48-volt electrical system with a 2 kWh smart battery, a 3600W inverter, and 200 watts of solar panels.
Bailey Endeavor Bailey's first ever panel van conversion is offered in two variants, the B62 and the B64. Both are based on a 3.5 ton chrome blue Ford Transit, but if the first one is designed for only two travelers, the second has a pop top to increase the sleeping capacity to four. Exploring new spots will be easier thanks to the standard 12 inch touchscreen infotainment system, air conditioning, cruise control, and a rear view camera. Each Endeavour is four season ready, featuring high performance Interflex insulated walls, a four inch thick single level bonded floor, a Truma diesel combi heating, and a hot water system. Depending on the chosen layout, the kitchen will be positioned in the middle or at the rear of the van, offering a three ring gas hub, a combination of a grill and an oven, a 90 liter Thetford fridge, and a drop down countertop extension. For the asking price, Bailey's equip each van with standard captain seats, an 11 feet wind out awning from Thule, a 100 watt solar panel, two 12 volt sockets, and four USB ports. Finally, both B62 and B64 can be specified with single bands. Off-Track Camper Sprinter The Hamburg, Germany-based Off-Track Camper is a conversion specialist that usually builds VW Transporter camper vans. This year, the company is adding a new Sprinter model that combines modern styling, solid off-road capability, and the latest technology. The conversion starts with a rear-wheel drive model powered by a 2-liter turbo diesel with 170 horses, though optionally, you could go for an all-wheel drive van with a 3-liter V6 diesel and 190 HP. Next, Off-Track adds Armaflex 3 4th inch insulation, oak vinyl flooring, poplar cabinetry with passive lighting, and a queen-size bed. A kitchen block with two domatic fridge drawers, an induction hub, and a sink is also included in the base package. To provide enough power to feed the mentioned appliances, the Off-Track fitted the Sprinter with a 3 kW Winverter and a 200 mph lithium battery from Master Vault. Finally, the camper manages to squeeze in a wet bath featuring a Klasana toilet system, a stainless steel shower tray, and a sink with Hans Grohe fittings. You also get a 112 liter freshwater tank and an insulated 55 liter wastewater tank located under the floor. Benchmark Vehicles Desso The latest camper van from the Oregon Benchmark Vehicles is underpinned by the Mercedes-Benz Sprinter 170 chassis, so as you can expect, it is a very, very expensive build even in its base configuration. The van is powered by a 2-liter turbo diesel with standard all-wheel drive and is additionally enhanced with an agile off-road suspension with Fox 2.0 shocks, Bilstein HD struts, and the new old Talon wheels wearing BFG K02 tires. Its rear doors house a spare tire carrier, a ladder, and an expedition box cargo carrier. While the roof gets loads of extra lights, 83 liter cargo box from Rome, and a Starlink dish, all mounted on a safari rack. The cabin of the Desso has a classic rear bed layout, but the bed is raised to make room for a full size gear garage underneath. The latter is fitted with a slide-out system that accommodates four bikes. Other available cabin equipment includes a semi-private bathroom, AC, and a luxury kitchen with two-stage water filtration from Gossel, a convection microwave, an induction cooktop, and even a Breville grind control coffee maker. These are powered by Zantrax 3 kW inverter paired with a 645 ampere hour battery and 245 watt solar panels from Zamp. Grounded G1 and G2 Operating out of the Detroit Innovation District since 2022, Grounded attracted former employees of Tesla and SpaceX with a shared goal to progress the electric revolution within the RV industry. The startup proudly states that they have delivered the first electric camper van to the American market and there is already the second, more capable model in the pipeline. The grounded G1 is based on the high-roof Ford e-Transit chassis with a limited range of 108 miles, 
but their next-generation camper swaps the platform in favor of the bright drop Zevo van that utilizes GM's Altium battery technology and has 250 miles of driving reserves. Grounded vans have fully modular interiors with limitless layouts, but the basic package would include a comfortable queen-size bed, bench seating with flip-up table, dry flush toilet, outdoor shower, kitchen with an induction cooktop and a fridge freezer combo, and surely 640 watts of solar to charge up.